Hello friends, welcome back. My name is Priyendra Kumar. In this video, I will tell you 10 different important use of mouse in Microsoft Excel. The first use is rename worksheet. You can rename the worksheet by just double click on the worksheet name and it will be available in edit mode. So just type new name here, let's say ABCD and it will be renamed. So just double click and you can get it renamed. The next is move data cells. You can move the data cells using mouse. I'll show you here. Let's say I have this data here. Just select this and hover over these cells. Then you will see mouse icon like this. And just click and move this cell anywhere where you want and just leave it you can see that cells move to different place so like this you can use move cells now let me undo this now the next is use fill handle we can use the fill handle so if you will click let's say on this Sunday and you are seeing the small dot option here just hover this and you will see a plus icon like this so this is the fill handle just click and drag it down so you can see the data has been filled you can fill the formulas also just this is some run between formula available here and just drag it down using this fill handle you can drag your data down or left or right any position now let me show you the next which is the hide and hide ribbon you can hide or unhide the ribbon using the mouse so you can see these options are visible in my excel if i will double click on this home then you can see now the option is hidden if you will double click again then it is visible on any of the option you can just double click it will be hidden or visible so by using the double click you can hide or unhide the ribbon of excel the next use is format painter. You can use the format painter to put the same format. Just select any data, go to the home. This is format painter. Just click here and you can just click here. So this same format is available here. If you want to put the continue format on multiple cells. So just select, let's say I want to select this range and just double click on the format painter you can click anywhere and the format painter will be available for the next clicks also to remove this format painter either you can press escape key or just click back on format painter format painter is also work for auto saves now let me show you so let me fill some format here in this save let's say this one now I want to give the same format to the other also. So let's say you have created a shape wherein you have given multiple formats. Then you can just select that shape, go to the home, double click here and just click, click, click and the same format will be applied and press escape. So that is how you can use the format painter using mouse. The next thing is column width. You can change the column width using mouse i'll show you here you can see i have multiple columns here if i want to auto fit this column then i can double click here in between of both columns when i will hover i'll get this type of mouse icon here just double click here then you can see this column has been auto fit now double click here and this column also has been auto fit if you want to auto fit all the columns on one click then you can select those columns like this any of the column you can just double click then you can see all the columns has been auto fit if you want to change the column width as per your requirement for all the columns now select all the columns like this and change the column width of any column and that will be changed for all the columns. So this is the use of mouse. You can change the column width using the mouse. The next thing is changing the row height. 
you also can change the row height using the mouse simply you can change the row height like this or you can auto fit the row also just select the rows multiple the entire row make sure you have selected just double click anywhere and you can see it has been auto fit double click and it will be auto fit the next is go to last cell i'll show you how we can use the mouse to going to the last cell of your table let's say this cell is active which is e5 i want to go to the last cell of this column only the last cell will be on the bottom so just hover here and double click on this line then it will be available automatically on the bottom if you want to go to the top of this column then just double click here so it will go to the top and similarly to going to the left you can double click here this is or going to right double click on this is now the next is right click to show the option you can right click anywhere to show the multiple options and then you can use any of the option accordingly similarly if you will right click on the worksheet then worksheet related option will be visible and you can use it the next is double click to edit the cell if you want to edit any cell you want to type some information in the cell double click here and you can start typing anything whatever you want to type inside it so these are the 10 use of mouse in microsoft excel i hope you have enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching